PAP is a company with a unique platform for trust. Typical cybersecurity solutions today takes averagely 200 days to detect. PAP detects and remediates in milliseconds and it's effective, it's low cost, and it's easy to scale. Yeah, PFP, Power Fingerprinting, relies on looking at uh, side channels. Uh, think about tiny changes in the power consumption or unintended electromagnetic emissions. Um, and we capture those, uh, perform power analysis on them, uh, and use those signals to train our uh, artificial intelligence and machine learning. Now we've been proven for industrial, utility, network, data centers, and IoT, and we're ready to roll. In terms of cybersecurity, we are very unique in that we actually perform a lot of signal processing. We also need a digitizer to, to you know, capture all the signals. So a sync technology is a perfect fit for this application because it allows us to do very powerful signal processing in a very small package, you know, very efficiently. This would be a perfect application for the Xilinx Zinc chip. And the main reason is, is because you've got a lot of RF processing that has to go on. You've got signal processing. Uh, this is very much like radar. And that's what we use the Zinc chip for, is literally to pick up that RF energy, process that using machine learning, learn what the normal behavior of the router, the ROM on, the iOS is, and then use that to characterize normal known good behavior. Zinc is perfect because we can put the netlist, the hardware, and the firmware back to known state. Right? Other devices only allow us to reset the firmware. And now we're moving into deep learning and the powerful Zinc devices that boast the logic and the ARM CPU allow us to do more number crunching such as deep learning. But another application would be if you had a device, an IoT device, industrial IoT device, or any other type of device that was based on the zinc chip, then the, another thing that you can do is you can actually instantaneously remediate because sensing the zinc chip through its own uh, XADC processor, you can immediately tell that something has gone wrong and something has been changed, and you can immediately then send signals to say, okay, reboot, reflash, uh, go back to an earlier version, etc. All of this can happen instantaneously, so you now have the ability to protect a device that's based on zinc architecture.